dairy farming in India under five months. So let's start. Dairy farming is a class of agriculture which involves long-term production of milk. Besides cow or buffaloes, species like sheep, goats, and camels are also involved. Dairy development has been part of India's most successful development program. India ran Operation Flood in 1960s under National Dairy Development Board. The operation was also known as White Revolution, which made India from milk deficient nation to largest milk producer of the world. After demonetization, lot of sectors were affected, especially informal ones. But during this phase, dairy farmers opened more than a million new bank accounts, which helped them get the funds directly into their bank accounts. There are two more main projects to be remembered under dairy farming in India. One is NABARD and the another one is that is National Dairy Development Board. National Dairy Development Board was set up by an act of parliament with its headquarters in Anand. Anand is a place in Gujarat which is also a base for Amul. It was founded by Dr. Varghese Kuren, who is known as Milkman of India. NDDB supports farmers with investments. White Revolution, which is Operation Flood, was carried out by NDDB. It was funded by World Bank. The other body is NABARD. NABARD, which is Apex Development Bank in India. I will make a separate video on this. NABARD provides subsidy to dairy farming and it helps to set up modern farm units and upgrade the quality. Helps in gaining self-employment. Engaged in agriculture and 21% of this share has livestock. This fact says that dairy could play a constructive role in promoting rural welfare and helps in reducing poverty. As employment is major concern in the time when India is on the peak of its demographic dividend, there is an opportunity for the unemployed youth to take up dairy farming as a job. Post demonetization, a millions of bank accounts were opened, but the ones staying in tribal areas could not operate. The banks should open branches in tribal areas so that more people open their account and there will be ease of payment, improving digital transaction. That's all for today. I'll meet you in the next video.